Hey everyone, Zero Chitty here with the XBLA Fans Channel. I'm here to go quick taste of Restless Night, a twin stick shooter with a sort of retro arcade inspiration. As you can kind of see here from the screen, uh, you fight waves of the undead ranging from zombies to skeletons to crows, which I may or may not be undead, uh, evil trees, and uh, witches and giant old pumpkins. There are bosses, they seem to be like every five levels or so. But anyways, uh, you have like just a normal, uh, you're progressing through levels, new game, and then an arena where you're just trying to survive. We're just going to go ahead with new game. So yeah, essentially, uh, whoever wins gets to go back home to be alive. And as you can see, move and shoot. This is me, and this is it. Uh, there are different weapons that you get. They do unlock at uh, uh, higher levels. Uh, that doesn't mean they're unlocked uh, fully. You have to pick them up. And there are other pickups at a spawn at the end of waves and stuff like that. Keep on shooting. My health's in the upper left. Uh, my progress through this current wave is on the bottom right. Grenade. That blows everything up. I've said this probably on a few videos that one of my, my essentially my favorite voice line of any video game is in Call of Duty Zombies. Kaboom! From uh, the nuke. I hardly play Call of Duty. I haven't even played a Call of Duty since I think uh, Infinite Warfare, the, the spacey one. Oop, speed. I'm gonna grab this. Uh, achievements are relatively easy. It's collect a certain amount of each power up, beat, and beat the bosses, uh, kill a certain amount of enemies, and uh, shoot a certain amount of times. Uh, the bosses are very, very uh, bullet spongy. Uh, but uh, most of them, if I remember right, uh, uh, give you uh, like little fodder enemies that'll file out and give you health. And the health pickups are like max health. Max ammo. I've encountered a uh, shotgun, ooh, shield, uh, a sort of rifle, a laser. Uh, the shotgun is clearly the best. It shoots a little V of bullets and they do a nice chunk of damage. Uh, some of the levels actually get pretty long. So as you can see, all these like blood trails get pretty big and some of the things have like green blood so it gets very uh christmasy red and green give this max health see like right now it's 30 so oop crows crows are the easiest to kill all those guys got stuck on a zombie haha your teamwork has failed you Gotcha. Some health. I don't need it. Oop. I don't need it. Instantly get hit. I think it's max health. I, I don't know because I either have max health uh, when I get it or I desperately need it and don't get it. Which is, I think, hilarious. This grenade. Oh, nope, jump in the well. Alright, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, crows. Thought you could sneak up on me there, did you? Here's some health. Don't, like I said, I don't need it. Might need it. Definitely need it. Gonna get hit. Okay, good. To get the laser. We're gonna push through. Get that. There we go. That's good. Sometimes it's better to take damage. It causes you to take less damage. Oh, grenade. Uh oh. All right. So the next one should be a boss. Ah. Uh, so the fun part is we're going to probably spend 99% of our chant time on this guy. Oops. I'm already doing a lot worse than I did before. I actually 
beat this dude the first time I played against him uh, without taking any damage at all. I don't know if the levels are fully randomized in their layout, but this one is actually pretty beneficial. Come on back out of here. I liked it. I liked it when you were out here more. What's that? It's mean. I don't like it. Don't touch me. I need my personal space. I need my me bubble. But yeah, I think 90% of my like firing was probably done versus just whittling down bosses because they all have just massive amounts of health. Even ones that I think give you, like, uh, other weapons? Still, it just takes forever. I want to point out, I want to let you look at this zombie right here. Doesn't even look like he's wearing, like, a little, uh, like, uh, uh, root, uh, a, um, what's it called? Do-rag on his head? And not like, I, I, I'm guessing they're supposed to be brains, but it looks like he's running around with like a, a do-rag. He's like, yo, what's up? Like I said, they just, they just, it's not, he's not particularly hard because he's spitting out tons of dudes to give you health and stuff. It's just like, well, also he's got a square around him. They, just, they didn't remove the, uh, what's it called? Uh, the, like the, the crop. He didn't get cropped correctly. Also, if you want a game for like true achievements where you need like a whole bunch of achievements for one game, this has 50 in it. I just got a triple kill there. Oh, there we go. All right, now he's kind of pissed off. Yeah, run over here and just mow these guys down. This laser should help out. Just a bit, but not too much. Oh, stuck in a corner. All right, we might wait for a, a little hungry little buddy to come on over here and help us out and give us some health. Perfect. Okay, so it, does, it is not max health, but it is still... Wow, he's really just loading me up on health. There it is. We did it. Kill that last one. Take this health. I don't need it, but I'm taking it. All right, let's go. Do do. So, see, I got my normal gun back. Uh, there's an achievement for dying nine times. I'm guessing that's a cat reference. Just... Cats have nine lives, if you didn't know that. One of the achievements is to shoot like 30,000 times. Which, uh, by the time I got to the last boss, I was pretty close to it. Ooh, grenade. Oh, I messed up. It's a very wet sound when you get hit. There we go, rifle. All right, give me some health or a grenade would be... Yo, oh, well. And you get your life back. Oh, evil pumpkin, and now he's orange. Skeletons. Oh, oh no, there's the witch. Oh no, so much is happening. I'll show you what happens when I die. Kill me. You also get a nice invulnerability period. Come on, who's gonna get me? I think a zombie got me. <laughs> you lose. I think you get the idea. I'm gonna quickly show you the, uh, uh, yes. Also, let's just continue from where you went. And uh, that helped me a lot. <laughs> And this is the arena. Clock at the bottom left. And then they just they just start throwing everything at you. 
But anyways, I am Zero JD. This is the XBLA Fans Channel. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, uh, ask down below in the comments, and I'll try to get back to you. Thank you. See ya.